everybody. Today we have all gathered together to have a group study session. I'm gathered by some probably familiar faces by now and yeah we've all got different methods of studying, different ways to revise, but it's nice to get out of our rooms in exam term and actually have some contact with other humans as well as studying at the same time. So yeah, here we go. So we all went to the Jesus College Study Centre for our group study session. Students often have supervisions in these rooms throughout the day. Luckily, on a Wednesday afternoon, the space was quiet and free for us to use. During exam term, the library can get really busy, so it's good to have another space we can go and study. For the first part of the session, we were all doing focused, silent study. Everyone had their own work to do. Although a lot of us are doing the same subject, physical natural sciences, we actually had quite a variety of work. Astrid on the left studies English, so she was going through an essay and highlighting it and reading it for a supervision. And Ella is a sciences student, so she's on the right and is doing some graph work. Look at these two go. Whoop whoop. And here I am writing essay plans for Earth Sciences. I'm using a laptop to type them up, but some people often just handwrite things, it's just what you prefer. My geology theory paper is made up of a load of mini essays, so I was practicing planning them. As with all study groups, some of us were definitely more focused than others. It turns out we'd actually let a couple of primary school boys in. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Ed and Will fancy themselves as comedians. <laughs> <laughs> However, as Ella demonstrates, when other people are hindering your studying, you just got to put them in their place. What, 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 well, don't that? talk to yourself, it's really annoying. I'm asking to the crowd. Well, we're all working. Yeah, let me continue. Like, can you actually not? Because I am trying to work. Yeah, it's fine. Yes, you tell them, Ella. You tell them. And here are Tim and Jacob working hard. Jacob was doing a maths tripos pass paper, while Tim was doing a couple of physics pass paper questions. With exams really fast approaching, we've got to the point where it's just exam question after exam question. Here we have Ella and Ed doing some collaborative work and discussing one of the physics questions at length. Yeah. Yeah. So we should have to ask the middle of the, you're in the middle between of the wire. Between the wire and the cylinder. You're doing between the wire and the cylinder? Yeah. Oh, okay, well that's still price. And the physics debate continued. For those interested, Ed's explanation was apparently wrong, so, um, I mean, don't always trust your friends, guys. Trust your gut instincts sometimes. I mean, I know we always want to think the best of people, but just putting it out there, this might have been Ed sabotaging Ella's work, so Ella, watch out. Here's Astrid putting the rest of us to shame by how much work she was getting done. Here she's making notes on a podcast on the play Richard II. You may think she's listening to music, but oh no, it's actually educational stuff. And now, shall we go and see what Will and Ed have been working on? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, guys, you're so funny. You have me in stitches. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But actually, it's kind of done on the end. Why don't we split them up? I don't know. <laughs> 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 you might need to split them up. And here I'll insert some footage of Ed and Will actually working because I know they'll be indignant if I painted a picture that said otherwise. I love how pretty that is. It's very pretty. I know. Do, do you want to show the camera? I think you should show the camera. Show the camera. Guys, prep yourself for Ella's fab physics work. Wowie! Kobe. Missed. So eventually we all settled back down and probably focused on our work. Some of us were listening to music, others weren't. I personally find I can't concentrate while listening to music. I really don't know how people do it, like I'd love to be able to. But then I know some of the others find they're more productive when listening to music, so it's individual to everyone. It did get to a point though where both Astrid and Ella were getting sick of their work. 
George, wanna try my I can I'm draw circles graphic. closer. No, I need to do this at some point. You, you can read this and learn this for me and I'll do yours. I'm alright. Yeah. We're looking at biblical so that it's a cute couple. Because <laughs> in case you didn't oh, know, me and Astrid are dating. Don't tell Luke. He watches the videos, he's gonna find out. What a scandal! And here we're on the final part of the first half of our revision session. Astrid volunteered to go to Sainsbury's to go get food, which was very kind of her. Sainsbury's is only like a five minute walk around the corner, so it was extremely convenient and we did need some fuel to help us through the second half of the revision session. Okay, so break is for 15 minutes. Uh, you, we are allowed to break for exactly these minutes, no more, otherwise you will be killed. <laughs> No. After 15 minutes the break was over and we got back to work. Or some of us did. Ed and Will were split up but I think Ed may have been the problem here because soon enough he was chatting to Tim instead. In Ed's own words, I quote, he said, in this revision session, I did very little maths, brackets, matrices. What we can take away is that group study is a productive environment for some, but not all. The good news is that I was being productive and I was on to my third essay plan at this point. I rather enjoyed this one actually because it was on planet habitability, so basically aliens, what's not to like? <laughs> I think the studying had just got to them. I mean, it's the only explanation for this weird behaviour. Well, this is going on YouTube. Like, you're just making making yourself look like an idiot. It's like a whole new approach to access. Like, if anyone could go to Cambridge, like, yeah, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, and here we have Jacob busy scribbling down his maths answers, and then we have Tim, who is staring at a question, still staring, still staring. And he gives up. It's a progression we all go through. The thing, yeah? Mm. About the thing? I still don't know the thing. Well, let's not find out now, but it's more work now. Exactly. Well said. Well, Ella knows, so. Who knows what? Ella knows the thing. Ella just knows the thing. Well, that thing. Not all the different thing, my thing. What thing? Yeah, she knows all things. She doesn't remember your thing. What thing? Wait, your thing? No, no, she no, no, you two know the thing, we don't know the thing. Wait, are you talking about the other thing? Do I know the thing? No, you don't know the thing. No, I know the thing. I mean, you don't know the thing. Oh, no, she knew the thing. She knew the thing. She knew the thing. Oh, I knew the thing. She knew the thing before she got told the thing. You know the thing that you said you wanted to the thing. I know the thing. Oh, that's the thing. Conclusion, we all know the thing. Cambridge students exposed, we are actually very bad at concentrating on work. But now back to work, Ella and Ed continue with their physics and maths respectively. 
And then we lost two as Will and Ed disappear off, letting the team down guys, letting the team down. The rest of us continued, we were almost at the end of our scheduled study session at this point. With four left standing, only the seasoned studiers continued. Our exams are actually three hours long, so endurance is quite an important thing. Discussion of graphs ensued. Good luck with your exam, ignore these guys, see you soon, bye!